So I made an add-on that makes your curve a rope simulation. Here's a short tutorial on how to use it. Go to edit, preferences and click install add-on and search for the python file you downloaded. Click install add-on and save the settings. Let's add a B0 curve into the scene. You will find the add-on in the object properties. Here it is, a big button that says curves to rope simulation. If you hit the button right now, nothing happens because the add-on wants to know how thick the rope is supposed to be. So go to geometry, bevel and add some depth. This will determine the rope's thickness. If we click this button now, it um, works. We play back the animation and the rope starts falling. But let's use a more interesting curve shape. Add a new P0 curve. Delete all of the points in the edit mode and use the draw tool to draw a random curve shape. Use the proportional editing and change it to random to displace the curve. Let's give it some depth again and use the button from my add-on. Now it starts to fall, which is good. Let's add a plane and add collision physics. So if you play back the animation, something interesting is happening. The rope collides with the floor. But now we can see that the rope isn't interacting with itself and just falls through itself. So you can go to the physics settings of the rope and go to collisions and activate self collisions. So if we play this back again, the rope is interacting with itself. Another cool feature of the add-on is that it automatically creates a vertex group that just waits for you to paint into it. So you only have to go to the weight paint mode and start painting some spots. And if we play back the animation now, the rope is pinned to these points. So if you want to add a texture to the rope, you have to make a slight adjustment to the UV map because the texture will be messed up. So just go to the UV editor and scale the UV map on the x-axis until it looks normal. And you can rotate it to make the texture fit the direction. You can see that the rope has a few modifiers. You can increase the levels of subdivisions if you are using a displacement texture on your rope. So I think this add-on could be useful for a bunch of stuff. You can quickly create an animation for cable poles or use it for something like a cyberpunk scene with a bunch of cables on the ground or to simulate noodles. The add-on is available on Gumroad, Blender Market and Patreon. The links are in the descriptions.